<laughs> All right, yeah, it's going. Go on. All right, Shalom, Shalom. Shalom. This your brother Lahab. Your brother, your wife is off. And uh, we Mississippi Gulf Coast House of Judah coming back at you again with a quick little live lesson, man. Lord willing, the uh, Lord willing is edifying to you, brothers and sisters out there tuning in. We're going to start off by giving infinite honor and infinite glory to the Most High and His Son, Yahweh Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shah Ba'ashem, Rekak Wadash. Double honors to our elders and apostles of Great Millstone who pushed your truth 100% and being a great example to us younger brothers that are in this faith. Oh. And peace and blessings to the Akiyam up under the elders pushing his truth throughout the four winds with all faith and sincerity. Oh. To you we say Shalom. Shalom. And uh, the title of this lesson, Get Ready. The prophecies draw nigh. And we, hey, man, and, and through the spirit, man, going through these these scriptures constantly paying attention to what's going on man in the world right now hey we see it man we oh. see the prophecies jumping off the page man oh. we see it and uh we're gonna get right into it lord willing is edifying to you brothers and sisters man you got it up all right this is um second Ezra 15 and 1 behold speak thou in the ears of my people the words of prophecy and what and are we hey starting with our apostles and elders on down to us younger brothers man hey that's what we out here doing man lord willing we up that number lord willing we men of the lord man uh -huh. and lord willing we are of the hopefully elect man this is what we out here doing man this is what we supposed to be doing this is the only thing that's really essential to life right now man living in this society man pushing this truth man Makes ma making your calling and election sh uh, sure, man. Sure. Is pushing this work, man. Pushing this truth, man. To the best of your ability, man. You got it up. Come, on, I got a quick precept. Uh, well, I'm gonna finish that out real quick, then I'll get mine. It says, "Behold, speak thou in the ears of my people the words of prophecy which I will put in thy mouth," says the Lord. Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shah. The Lord said He gonna put this in our mouth, man. We ain't choose the Lord, man. The Lord chose us, man. When we, when we out there on them highways and byways, man, we're we're not we're not speaking of our own accord, man. We are we are speaking the words of the Lord, man. We we not hey, this ain't something we just came up with, man. This ain't something the apostles just say, oh man, let, let's just do it. No, man, this is something the Lord chose us to do, man. This is the Lord's words, man. You got it, up. Come on, I got a quick precept. This is uh, Amos 3 and 7. Surely the Lord power, Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shah, will do nothing but he reveals his secrets unto his servants, the prophets. That's right, man. If the Lord is truly dealing with you, man, hey, you you gonna you gonna really take it in, you're gonna understand what's going on, man. Come you're on. gonna understand, you're gonna really get the understanding of what you've been taught in this truth man Come. because we 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 have all been taught this in this truth man we we didn't come up with this man we don't we ain't just sit back and say okay this mean that and that mean this no we was taught this thing man Come. by our apostles and the elders man that are over us man right through the spirit and power of Shem Shah. Come, through the spirit and power of yahweh by shim yahweh shah you got it, right? That was yeah. it on that? I got another precept real Kinda, quick. you got it. You know, and hey, what the scriptures say, faith come by hearing, man. Hearing mm -hmm. what? This word, man. So in order for you to truly understand what's being revealed unto you, you have to have faith. True faith, man. That's right. You know, non-wavering, man. Uh, uh, that foundation, you have to have that foundation built upon that rock, man. Unmovable, unshakable, man. Mm -hmm. You know? But uh, this is it real quick. This is uh, Habakkuk. And if I can add Go real ahead. quick, Bob, for shot. Sure. Hey. And if and if you and if something don't look right to you, hey man, speak up, man. Come on. If you got a question about something, speak up on it, man. I mean, that's the only way you're gonna truly get understanding. Come on. That's what all brothers are here for. If you don't understand something, you think this, you think, okay, well, I don't, I don't know about this, brother. Can you what 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 about this? What does this mean right here? Right, right. Get, get understanding on it, man. Come on. And if you get, and if you can accept the understanding, you can accept the breakdown. Right. Hey, you didn't grow. You didn't grow. But if you can't accept it, you can't. You pray for pray. it. Pray, or either she had, Hey, go do your own thing. That's all we can say about the matter. <laughs> uh, do your own thing on that. You this, got it up. This Habakkuk uh, two on one. It says, "I will stand upon my watch and set me upon the tower, and will watch to see what he will say unto me." Mm -hmm. 
-hmm. and what I shall answer when I am reproved. Mm. It says, and the Lord answered me and said, write the vision and make it plain upon a table that he may run that readers it. That's right, man, that he may run that readers it, man. When you, when you take hold with, if you, it's, man, it's made plain upon the table to the elect. The elect oh. is, is not going to have no problem grasping, once grasping the understanding of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shah's words when they hear it, man. Oh. They're going to take it, they're going to run with it. And they're gonna they're gonna push it to the best of their ability, man. Con. No matter what, you got it up. Con. It says, uh, and Lord willing, we are part of that star when our apostles and elders on down to us younger brothers, the part of the elect. It says, for the vision is yet for an appointed time, but at the end it shall speak and not lie. Mm -hmm. Though it tear, wait for it, because it will surely come. It will not tear. That's right, man. And hey, man, and we can and we see what's going. We can see the prophecies. Jumping off right now, man. Come on. I mean, it, it would it it would be it would be different if we we don't see if the prophecies not ha we clearly see it, man. Come on. All around the board. All, every every which way, we see it. If you if if you paying attention to what's going on in the world, I mean, hell, look at look at the, we 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 can see the 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 famine about to start, man. We can see this, man. Right. And the scriptures get into that. That was it on that note? Yeah, you want me to go back? Oh, uh, come on, come on. This, uh, Second Ezra 15, and, uh, you want, okay, yeah, in verse yeah. 2, it says, And cause them to be written in paper, mm -hmm. for they are faithful and true. That's right, man. Cause it to be written in paper. Guess what? Man wrote this, wrote these scriptures down on paper, man. Right. But guess what? This is the Lord's words, man. Shit, I got you a quick one to back you real quick. You want it? And it says they are faithful and they are true, man. You got it. I, yeah, yeah, yeah. Go ahead and get it. Con, this uh, this uh, Psalm sixty-eight and eleven. It says the Lord gave the word. Mm -hmm. Great was the company of those that published it. That's right, man. And when you publishing something on on paper, what you doing? You writing it down, right? Con, you writing it down, man. Men, men. It said great was the great was the company of those who published it, man. Meaning this this was men of the Lord writing it, writing these words down, man. Come on. Seeing the, seeing these visions happen and, and, and writing it down, man. Come on. I got you that definition of publish. You want it? Come on, go ahead. This uh publish, online etymology, publish. Um it says make publicly known. Make publicly known. Reveal. Reveal. Di divulge. <laughs> announced. You know, that's basically the point. Spread abroad, make a uh, spread abroad, make public, communicate, make public. I mean, I, I mean, uh, public pertaining to the people, mm -hmm. you know, and that's, that's hey, it how, says. And, to, and, and if I can add, how do you mm -hmm. make something public if you don't, if you don't, if you ain't writing it down to where everybody can get it? Mm -hmm. You got it up. It says um, to people. Uh, well, that's that's basically it. man. That's mm -hmm. the point, you know. Gone. That's basically the point. Announcing, declaring, I mean that's it. Yeah, man. You know? And that hey, and that's what we doing now, man. Gone. Lord willing we of the men. Lord willing we of that number, man. Storing our apostles and elders on down to us younger brothers, man. We making we 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 making this thing, we publishing this word, man. You got it up. Alright, come on. That was it? On yeah, that? on that um okay. Alright, this uh back in second Ezra fifteen. Yeah. In verse three, yeah. fear not the imagination against thee. Mm -hmm. Let not the incredulity of them trouble thee, that yeah. speak against thee. That's right, man. And and when you go into that word incredulity, man, it goes into unbelief, man, non-believing. Hey, and man, hey, hey, and one thing about it, man, we too, we it's we way too far in the game, man. We way too far in the game to 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 be trying to goddamn speak against this truth or or come against the people who done taught us this truth man right who opened the door for us who paved the way for us man come on which which we know it wasn't nothing but the spirit of the lord man but still in all man our apostles and elders paved the way for us man come on we live in today works man i got you a quick precept you want or you want me to keep going Con, you got it up this uh matthews 24 and 24 for there shall arise false amashiachs Mm -hmm. Amashiachim and false prophets and shall show great signs and wonders in so much that 
if it were possible, they shall deceive the very elect. That's right, man. We're gonna have we're gonna have we're gonna have people come up against the come up against the Lord. We're gonna have people come up against the Lord, man. And what it said, if at all possible, they could they could they could they could, they could waver the, the the elect, man. Fine. That's how hard and smooth and cunning they gonna come, man. Fine. But guess what, man? Hey, it's not, possible. it's not possible, man. That's why I said if at all, if 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 it were possible. Fine. <laughs> but it's not possible, man. Fine. I got you another one to bounce that one. Kind, you got it. Up. This is John ten and twenty eight, and I give unto them eternal life. Talking about the elect, mm -hmm. and they shall never perish. Neither shall any man pluck them out of my hand. Ooh, that's right, man. Can't nobody, can't nobody sway the way of the of the elect, man, because the elect are sealed from the beginning, man. Come on. That was it, though. Come on, bro. Yeah, yeah. Just uh, uh keep going. Yeah, keep going. It's Matter of fact, read read verse three over again. Uh, Bible Kishore. It's uh Second Ezra fifteen and three. Feel not the imagination against thee. Let mm -hmm. not the incredulity of them trouble thee that speak against thee. Cause this is gonna happen, man. This is all prophesied to happen, man. We gonna always have people come up against us, come up against the men, come up against the men of the Lord. I'm gonna mm -hmm. say it like that. Lord willing, we up the men. We gonna always have people come up against the Lord, man. Right. It happened. It happened back in the day, and you shit. You think it ain't gonna happen now? Right. You and, got it. Up. And one of the main causes of that because Jake don't know how to wait. Don't they? They let the flesh overweigh the spirit, man. Mm -hmm. And they get in tune. They get. They get. It, it get. Get in, in depth and, and involved. With too much of their own pride and emotions, man. You gotta let that shit go, man. You gotta, that's why the scriptures tell us, man. That's the main thing, you know. As you know, we it's being pushed through the spirit, you know. But it's a lot. To do. That's what we tell all the time. We talking amongst the brothers, you know, in our camp, you know, amongst ourselves, whatever it may be, man. Hey, examine yourself, man. Mm -hmm. Daily, whether you're in the faith, we gotta we gotta constantly stay on top of ourselves, man. Right. We always say, hey, man, you gotta keep your foot. On that old man neck, keep his ass buried, man. That's right. You know, cause hey man, hey Apostle uh Gabar, you know, he went in on it, you know, um, you know, cause shit, hey, we in these and we through the spirit we understand, but you know, he touched on it, man. We in these wicked we all fucking wicked, man. But we have this spirit to 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 correct us and guide us and to chasten us, man. That's right. So correction gonna come, whether it's you correcting yourself, the Lord using other men to correct you. I mean, it's gonna come. We just gotta accept it. If you truly believe, you truly want some salvation. You gonna accept it, man. Mm -hmm. You know you gonna put that fucking pride to the side, and you are gonna think like, man, shit. There's a reason why this is happening. There's a reason why this brother telling me this, man. You know, cause it ain't like brothers just in this thing just to, like uh, getting the Lord over brothers or you know, cause we understand the Lord sees all these different things. So to the best of our ability, man, we trying to a hey, be directed right, right in the right way. I mean, the right path and direct in the right path, man. And that comes right. with what uh, being led by the Spirit, man. So it's gonna come things that 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 your flesh is not gonna like, that your mind is not gonna like, because the scriptures say our minds is desperately wicked, man. But we have to put on uh, the mind of Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shah, and that comes with us actually studying to show ourselves approved, man. Mm -hmm. Examining yourself, working out your own salvation, man. Applying these scriptures, man. That's right. Seeking counsel, man. Speak. Sp hey, if you you don't understand, speak on it. Okay, and you still ain't you know declared it. Hey. Humble down, take that, be quiet to yourself, and pray to the Lord for the understanding, man. That's right. And have faith that the Lord is going to reveal it to you. Nothing wavering, man. And just be patient. Suffer it, man. There's a reason why it's, it, you, you might not have it right then and there, man. But you got to keep the faith that you will get it, man. God. You know? Right, so like y'all. Um, you got it, bro. All right. Uh, verse uh, 4. Uh, kind, kind, kind. It says... For all the unfaithful shall die in their unfaithfulness. That's right, man. Ooh, that's good right there. I like that. That one that's 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 one of my favorite scriptures right there. All the unfaithful shall die in their unfaithfulness. So you hey, you 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 hey man, these niggas out here taking chances coming up against the Lord, man. Come on. You if you ain't got no faith in your how about Shim Yahweh the Lord say you're gonna die in your unfaithfulness, man. Mm -hmm. Matter of fact, get uh Baba Kushar. Real quick, I, can you grab Romans. me uh, nah, uh, right. Proverbs 13 and 13? All right. So, like, I'm going to get, uh, okay, here you go. Proverbs 13, 13. Kind. This Proverbs 13, 13. It says, Whoso despises the word shall be destroyed, but he that fears the commandment shall be rewarded. That's right, man. Whoso despises this word 
y'all gonna be destroyed, man. Point blank, period, man. You know, you, hey, man. Once again, we are too far ahead in this thing, man. We are too close to the end to be trying to move backwards, man. Mm -hmm. It's we too close, man. That was it on that up. Yeah, yeah. And shit, hey, what it said? We gotta fear. We gotta fear the Lord, man. Fear the Lord. And what you gonna do if you fear the Lord? You gonna keep His commandments? Cause you feel what the Lord can do to you, man. You had anything up? Yeah. You got it. All right, come on. It is right here. Um, all right. This is um. This is Second Timothy's. Uh, let me see. Let me just get it right here. Salakia. So like it's Second Timothy's uh three. And I'm gonna start at uh fourteen. It says, I right, hold on. Okay. Let me see. All right. Let me yeah, I'm gonna get it. It says, uh I'll get straight to it. This is 2 Timothy 3 and 14. But continue thou in the things which thou hast learned and has been assured of, knowing of whom thou hast learned them. Mm -hmm. And that from a child thou hast known the holy scriptures, which are able to make thee wise unto salvation through faith, which is in Amashiach, Yahweh Shah. Mm -hmm. All scripture is given by inspiration of the Most High and is profitable for doctrine, for reproof, for correction, for instructions and in righteousness. That the man of the Most High may be perfect, thoroughly furnished unto all good works, man. So, hey, like the brother says, it's too, it's too late in the game, man, to be coming against, you know, a hey, Yahweh by Shimei And that goes with who the men is dealing with, who the Yahweh Salaki, who Yahweh Shah is dealing with, man. The men start with our apostles and elders, you know, who who taught us this truth, man. You know, if we, hey, we, we believe that they, they the, the, the name that they taught us. Right. You know, we believe the breakdowns that they taught us. Right. You know, we believe that they are the men of the Lord. So why not? With the, with the, they, 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 they watching over our soul just as well as they own, man. So now, why not? Why, why now all of a sudden, you know, uh, be in disagreements, man? You know, no, man. Hey, we have to be, a, we have to continue those things that we was taught, man. That's right. You know, and keep praying and keep fearing, man, and keep giving diligence, keep examining ourselves, man. Mm -hmm. That's it, man. You know, that's it. You know, yeah, we might not have a, uh, shit. We we haven't met none of the apostles, but shit, right. we believe they men of the Lord. You damn right. Shit, we we never met them, but we believe what they what they was teaching, what they teach, not yeah. what they were, what they teach, man. Hmm. Shit, I, wholeheartedly, and Lord willing, Lord keep that spirit on us, man. God, that's right. You bro. know, so I believe everything that they teach. You damn shit, right. I don't got no disagreements with it, and Lord willing, I keep the same spirit, the same energy, man. God. You know, because hey, man, it's a fearful thing to fall into the hands of the living power, man. Mm -hmm. You know, but um, that was that was based on all I had right there with right that. You want me to go back in that second address? Mm, yeah, kind of, kind of, kind of. All right, this second address, uh, fifteen. I think you on verse five and five. <laughs> you know, um, behold, says the Lord, I will bring plagues upon the world: the sword, famine, death, and destruction. That's right, man. Hey, we we see it happening, man. Look at look at what's going on right now as we speak, man. We see food prices, man, about to skyrocket, man. Have mm -hmm. skyrocketed. You got you got videos of fucking thousands of fucking cattle just dead, man. Right. This ain't no coincidence, man. Come on now. You this is the Lord's doing, man. Right. You got in Texas, they banged them broke. You know, so they out of water. They out of water, man. You know. This is all the Lord's doing, man. And if, if and if, if and if nobody can see this, man, it's some hey, all the unfaithful gonna die in their unfaithfulness, man. Right along with this place, man. Right, right, right along with Babylon the Great. And if I can add real quick, you know that should show you that America is just is is, is Babylon. America is is finished, man. Because you got American uh politic politicians and shit, presidents, president and shit. He's sending all this aid over there to overseas, but yet you have problems here, man. Right. Major problems here, man. You send all this motherfucking aid and help over there to, 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 to these foreign countries, and yet the people over here got down, you got people over here homeless, starving, you know, uh, 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 just, just fucked up, man. You know, the, the, the infrastructure is, is, is fucked up. It's an F, you know. 
food is fucked up, but yet you send all this money, all this aid, and just on goddamn uh, 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 different uh, news outlets talking about uh, aid Ukraine, peace in Ukraine, all this, all this old bullshit, man. But yet your people over here, the, where the American people over here is, is going through it, catching hell, man. You know, I just show you, man, this, this this fucking place is a joke. It needs to be destroyed, man. Mm -hmm. You know? You got all this different, just, it's just nothing but a confusion just jumping off in this place, man. You know, mind-boggling shit, man. Shit you never think that you, you don't, that you, I mean, it's just mind-boggling. I'm just leaving it at that, bro. You mm -hmm. want me to keep going? Mm -hmm. you, don't, you don't want to you don't, so yeah, pull yeah, up yeah. on it. Yeah. Shit. Let me just keep going, finish it off. Uh, can stop at verse 12. All right. It says, um... For wickedness has exceedingly polluted the whole earth, and their hurtful works are fulfilled. Therefore, says the Lord, I will hold my tongue no more as touching their wickedness, which they profanely commit. Neither will I suffer them in those things in which they wickedly exercise themselves. Behold, the innocent and righteous blood cries unto me, and the souls of the just complain continually. Hey, and what that, who, what that sound like, man? That sound like America, man. Babylon the Great, man. And what he said, they who who over here signed in crime, man? Uh, pursuing to uh, Ezekiel, what it is nine and four, I believe it is, um, where it said where it said they they the uh, sign in crime for the abominations that are done thereof, man. The men out on the highways and byways, man, constantly praying to the Lord, man, for for salvation, man. Um, and that's what we have to be doing constantly, man, daily, man, um, praying to the Lord, man. Please, Lord, come get us, man. Please, we need salvation. Beg, beg the Lord, man. Because this is not it, man. This is straight bullshit over here, man. This is not our rest, man. No, and the men that, didn't, uh, that, that died in the faith, man. You know, they constantly complaining in the spirit realm. Come on. You know, and we know, hey, like your brother said, that's talking about America, Babylon, man. Esau, Edom. You know, because he's the one that, that polluted the whole earth and got everybody... You know, two thirds and, and, and these heathen nations exercising heavily in wickedness, man. Mm -hmm. Promoting all this old perverse ass shit, man. But I'm gonna right. keep going. It says, and therefore says the Lord, I will surely avenge them mm -hmm. and receive unto me all the innocent blood from among them. Mm -hmm. Behold, my people is led as a flock to the slaughter. I will not suffer them now to dwell in the land of Egypt. Ooh, the land of Egypt. When you go in that word of Egypt, what that is, the house of bondage, man. Did we not? Did we not come from the house of bondage? And it's gonna get even more in depth. You got it out. It says, "But I will bring them with a mighty hand and stretched out arm and smite Egypt with plagues as before." They, as before, man. So he talking about he talking about Egypt right now, man. The modern day Egypt, the future Egypt right here, man. Which is a, which is Babylon the Great, A.K.A. America, man. It says, and what it said, he said he will he will he will smite Egypt with plagues as before, and will just you got it up, and will destroy all the land thereof. That's right, man. This place is going to get obliterated, man. You got it up. Egypt shall mourn, and the foundation of it shall be smitten with the plague, mm -hmm. and the punishment that the Most High shall bring upon it. That's right, man. Hey, and, and this is going to happen, man. We see it happening right now before our eyes, man. So hey, we we hey we need to be getting ready, man. And uh, yeah. And uh, matter of fact, we're gonna end it with uh, Isaiah fifty. Give me Isaiah fifty-five and eleven, Baba Kasha. We end it off on that one. This is Isaiah 55 and 11. It? No. it says, So shall my word be that goes forth out of my mouth. It shall not return unto me void, but it shall accomplish that which I please, and it shall prosper in the thing where, whereto I sent it. That's right, man. The Lord said his mouth, his words is not going to go forth out of his mouth void, man. This is going to happen, and we have faith in it that it's going to happen, man. We have faith that the Lord is going to come back and redeem his elect, man. We have faith that the Lord is going to come and destroy this place, man. You know? And uh, you had anything else? No, that's it. And uh, with that, 
Lord willing, this lesson was edifying to you brothers and sisters out there tuning in. And we're going to close out by giving infinite honor and infinite glory to the Most High and His Son. Yahweh Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shah, Ba'ashem, and and double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone who pushed his truth 100%, being a great example to us younger brothers, and peace and blessings to the Akim up under the elders, pushing his truth throughout the four winds with all faith, sincerity, and in diligence. To you he say Shalom. Shalom. And a Baal Baal. Baal Baal. Kwam Yasha Allah. Kwam Yasha Allah. Shalom. Shalom.